KTSM 9 News is your local election headquarters, and today is election day in New Mexico. Borderland residents are still heading to the polls to cast their vote. KTSM 9 News reporter Shelby Cap is live from Las Cruces, where she has been speaking with voters. And Shelby, how is the turnout out there? Yeah, well, Natasia, we've been out here for a couple of hours, and you can see that line of voters behind me. It hasn't been much shorter than that the entire time. People keep coming to cast their vote for the primaries. Well, it's my civic responsibility, and I think now more than ever, it's important for us to get out there and, and get the vote. There's too many awful things happening in our country, and I'm hoping by being out here that we'll be able to make a difference. The county clerk saying there are 130,000 registered voters in Doniana County, but only about 12% had voted in the primary elections as of a few hours ago. But lines continue. Actually looking pretty promising. It has been, I've been calling it a little bit sluggish, a little bit slow heading into election day. But I'm happy to see that so far today we've had um, as many people uh, who have voted in early voting are already voting on election day. So we're looking at near about 12,000 total. One race on the ballot draw, drawing attention is for the Doniana County Sheriff with two Democrats and two Republicans running. Now the polls close tonight at 7 p.m., but here in Doniana County you can vote at any polling center. And if you're in line by 7 p.m., you will be able to cast your ballot. And if you are an independent, I'll have some information that you might want to hear coming up on KTSM 9 News at 6. Reporting live from Las Cruces, Shelby Cap, KTSM 9 News.